So in this video, I'm going to show you how I got rid of my really bad dandruff and transformed my dry and itchy scalp to a super clean, healthy scalp again. And even days later, there's not a single flake in sight, all because of this one mixture that I applied onto my scalp and hair. So keep on watching because this is going to save your life. What's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Amber and I don't know about you, but me, ugh, I suffer from dandruff and an itchy scalp. It's so bad lately. Like girl, I cannot even, it look, my hair looks fine right now, you know, but I'm going to zoom in in a second. So definitely keep on watching to see how much flakes, how much dandruff I have. Okay. My scalp is definitely not in a good state. And yeah, it has worsened since past few months and I don't know why. I don't know what I've been doing wrong. Maybe is the products I use? No, not really because I've been using the same old products since forever. So I don't know, it's just strange. You know, it's just strange. And today is the day that I'm gonna do something about this because it came to the point where I don't really feel like doing box braids or cornrows in my hair because I know the flakes and the dandruff is going to be super visible and crazy after just a few days. And I don't want to deal with that. I hate dandruff so, so much. Ugh, guys, it's not even like my hair looks fine. Okay. My hair looks fine from here, but I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about because it's not even funny. Like I haven't washed my hair in two days only. You know, it's been two days and there are no products in my hair currently, right? Um, because I wanted to see if the flakes and the dandruff is because of the products that I use. Maybe the products are causing product buildup and flakes. Maybe they are not the right products for my hair. I don't know. I was just thinking about something and yeah, <laughs> the flakes are still here. So it's definitely not the products that I use. Okay. So I'm going to part my hair. <gasps> oh my gosh. You see that? I shampooed my hair thoroughly. I shampooed my scalp with a sulfate shampoo. I conditioned my hair and it's still looking like this. I don't know if you guys can see, but if I do this, all the flakes are just flying around <laughs> everywhere. You see it's all over here as well on my hair strands. And I know you cannot really see it on camera, but my scalp is definitely dry. There's flakes everywhere and this is just from not washing it for two days. Okay, so I took a towel because I am going to do an apple cider vinegar rinse. Apple cider vinegar works amazing for situations like this. I tried apple cider vinegar in the past before and I loved it, especially during the maximum hydration method. I made a whole video about it. Apple cider vinegar made my hair, like made my curls pop and defined tremendously. It was crazy. So what I'm going to do today is I have a spray bottle here with warm water and this is one part water and I'm going to put one part of apple cider vinegar in it. And this is actually filtered apple cider vinegar as you can see because it's clear. Let me focus. Yeah, this is clear, right? And to get the best results, you should actually use the unfiltered one because in the unfiltered one, there's all the nutrients inside and stuff. Because usually I get the Brax one, the organic one, unfiltered with the mother in it. That's the one you should use, okay? You can get it at any store. It's everywhere. So yeah, I really recommend that brand. But you know, if you just have regular apple cider vinegar, it works just as fine. Hopefully I'm going to try it out today. So in my spray bottle, I'm going to put one part of apple cider vinegar as well to dilute it. Obviously don't use it straight on your scalp because it's very acidic. It will probably hurt. So always, always dilute it with water. So I'm going to spray onto my scalp. Make sure that my scalp is covered and then I'm going to cover the rest of my hair strands with this mixture as well. It's the end of the weekend. 
but I still wanna turn up Yeah, I still wanna turn up All I want is to go again But you ain't picking your phone up Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day Let me take you away All I need is just saying yeah, 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 yeah Better nights, better days When you're here with me, babe Cause you're all that I crave So I wonder Oh my gosh, that smells so, so bad. Whew. But, so I just rubbed in the apple cider vinegar on my scalp and on my hair strands, but to maximize the effect, I'm gonna use a scalp brush. The benefits of a scalp brush, they remove build up they increase blood circulation and they are great to massage with oil but in this case i'm gonna massage the apple cider vinegar into my scalp because you know so this is how my scalp massager looks like just you know a regular one from a brand called curly secret but you can find this literally everywhere i still have half of the mixture left so i'm gonna respray my hair again even though it's really wet i want to make it soak it wet and it's actually crazy how defined my curls are you see the apple cider vinegar it defines curls you know i just used some apple cider vinegar and that's it but don't leave this product into your hair please <laughs> so i'm gonna Ooh, that actually feels really good if you really press onto your scalp. Maybe I can do this with like a very lightweight oil as well in the future. This thing really helps, you know, to loosen up all those flakes of your scalp it definitely creates tangles that's something that i don't like but i can feel you know the dirt being lifted off my scalp i'm gonna use this in the shower as well so i'm gonna leave this on for an extra 10 more minutes and then i'm gonna hop in the shower wash my hair uh, do my scalp massaging again condition my hair and I'll be back to show you guys the end results. Okay, I just stepped out of the shower and I shampooed my hair with a sulfate shampoo. Um, not a moisturizing shampoo, just something that is really gonna cleanse my scalp and hair again. Even though I, I use a sulfate shampoo every once in a while, but I don't know. I just hope this time it will have an, a different effect, right? Because I use my scalp massaging brush again while shampooing to really lift the flakes off my scalp. And honestly, my scalp feels clean. Not gonna lie, my scalp feels very clean right now. And I conditioned my hair as well because I had a ton of tangles from the scalp massaging brush. So I conditioned my hair, I detangled my hair again. And now we are here, right? So we are about to see if it worked. I don't know, I hope so because that was literally my last hope. Okay, okay. I wanna see in close up how it looks. Oh my gosh, it looks clean. Remember how my hair looked before? It was full with flakes right here and it's squeaky clean right now no way it really worked guys all these flakes really got lifted off my scalp and rinsed off <gasps> this is definitely something that i'm gonna do often <laughs> okay wow oh my gosh no, seriously, this really made my scalp seriously clean. There is not a flake in sight. Not a single flake at all. <laughs> okay, so this is definitely a method that I recommend 100%. 
I wouldn't do this uh, every week though, maybe like twice a month or once a month. I don't know, it depends on how bad it is, but if you suffer from dandruff and itchy scalp and flakes, get you the apple cider vinegar mixture with a scalp massaging brush. That combination is amazing. Okay, it's amazing. There's nothing more I can say. You guys saw for yourself how it looked before and how it's looking now. My hair is clean and fresh. Like, I can, I feel confident now to do my hair this weekend. Like, I can call my sister-in-law and ask her to do some cornrows in my hair because it's super hot outside. So, yeah, that's an amazing summer style. I'm ready for summer. Yeah, okay, I'm happy. Yay! <laughs> Finally fix it. Why didn't I do this sooner? If I knew, I was just too lazy. But now I know, okay, it works. So yeah, I hope this video helped someone out there with the same issues as me. Please try it out. Let me know what you think of this method. If you tried it out, do you like it? Let me know in the comment section. So thank you so, so much for watching this video. I appreciate it. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.